Imre Nagy was a Hungarian communist politician who was appointed chairman of the Council of Ministers of the Hungarian People's Republic on two occasions. Nagy's second term ended when his non-Soviet-backed government was brought down by Soviet invasion in the failed Hungarian Revolution of 1956, resulting in Nagy's execution on charges of treason two years later. Nagy was born in Kapisvar, to a peasant family and was apprenticed to a locksmith. His father, Joseph Nagy, 1869-1925, was a manorial servant, a county worker, and was later post-assembly worker, and his mother, Rosalia Sabo, 1877-1969, served as a maid before she was married. He enlisted in the Austro-Hungarian army during World War I and served on the Eastern Front. He was taken prisoner in 1915. He became a member of the Russian Communist Party and joined the Red Army Citation needed Nagy returned to Hungary in 1921. In 1930, he traveled to the Soviet Union and rejoined the Communist Party, also becoming a Soviet citizen. He was engaged in agricultural research, but also worked in the Hungarian section of the Comintern. He was expelled from the party in 1936 and later worked for the Soviet Statistical Service. Rumors that he was an agent of the Soviet Secret Service surfaced later, begun by Hungarian party leader Karoly Grosh in 1989, allegedly in an attempt to discredit Nagy. Nagy evidently did serve, however, as an informant for the NKVD during his time in Moscow and provided names to the secret police as a way to prove his loyalty, a common tactic for foreign communists in the Soviet Union at the time.